Also breaking, a Kankakee High School teacher recorded using a racial slur in the classroom has been fired. Let's get right to Elizabeth Matthews. Elizabeth, the vote was unanimous. That's right, Corey and Don. A lot of parents showed up at this school board meeting here in Kankakee to just to see how the school board was going to handle this, how they were going to go forward. And it was a unanimous decision to fire math teacher John Donovan. Tonight, the student involved, his family say they're happy with this firing, but they want more. And typing mentally, like, you know, saying that, knowing that that never happened to me before. And no, nobody had never called me that before. For a teacher that had called me that, I'm um, just shocked, speechless. Does he have no place um, belonging if he's going to uh, continue with these actions, you know, the action that he did take, especially against my son? The incident happened Thursday morning and was caught on cell phone video from another student in class. It happened at Kankakee High School, and Donovan can be heard using a racial slur towards Michael, a sophomore following, the school district says, a minor argument. A Facebook post says school leaders quickly apologized to the students who were affected, and the teacher, Donovan, was removed from the classroom and escorted off school grounds. He has been on paid administrative leave ever since, until now his firing, which is effective immediately tonight. The victim's attorney says there was another incident two weeks ago when he alleges Donovan threw a book at Michael and their fight is not over. And this is really disturbing because they're just trying to put a Band-Aid and wipe this under the rug saying, oh, look, we fired the teacher in five days. Look how great we are. When in fact, this teacher had abused this student, abused Michael. Two weeks before, he threw a book at him. I mean, this is battery. He, he, he attacked him, and the school did nothing. The family's attorney says that he actually has a meeting with the superintendent tonight following the school board meeting where he'll discuss how to go further. He says he wants everyone to be held accountable for that incident that happened two weeks ago. Anyone that knew about uh, that alleged book throwing towards Michael, he wants them to be held accountable. He says if it comes to a lawsuit, then so be it. In Kankakee, Elizabeth Matthews, Fox 32, Chicago.